Hi, uh, this is a quick guide reference uh, video to uh, set the cup cup five uh, counter rate counter for uh, depth indicators. Um, I have a um, I think it's the latest. The latest uh, quick overview of the um, the counter, and uh, we just need to set uh, just basically three three settings uh, to be able to count the depth. Okay, uh, those settings are gonna be. This is a. Input line one, this one here. We're gonna set um, the input A and B. It's gonna be quad. We're gonna choose quad one. Uh, this one we're gonna go to zero point zero, and then 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 uh, this one here. It's gonna. It's a number that's gonna change depending on on size of the drum and uh, cable and uh, and on this case I'm doing this one for uh, a setting for a 3110 with a M50 winch and uh, the setting for in, in this case is gonna be zero point one 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 nine. So this is the only three settings that we're gonna do. On this, um, on this case. All right, the, I have here a um, a rate indicator. So we're gonna go real quick and and and, and it, uh, put these three settings. All right, first we're gonna um, hold the left bottom cell, hold it until you go into the programming mode. Then we're gonna uh, press the right button to get into the line one. You can see line one. All right, again, uh, I'm gonna get out real quick. I'm gonna go, go again into the, um, this is the main screen. So you're gonna, again, hold left button and you get into the programming mode. It's gonna switch between pro and no. So if you click this the right button, you get into line one, line two, line three, line four, line five, and you get to the beginning again. So we're gonna go, go get into the line one, then you press the left button and you get into the first the first setting. Right? So with the right button you can switch between different modes and you need to choose the quad one then press the left button and you go to the second setting which we're looking for 0, 0.0 so you can have two decimal point three uh, on our case we're gonna go just go ahead and use one 0, 0.0 then you click again and on this setting is we're gonna look for uh, the setting that we need depending on the winch size drum or uh, or on this case we have a, a winch. Uh, the depth indicator is located at the winch on this case. Um, so on this case for the 3110 with an M50 winch we're looking for, like I said before, 0 0.1119. So we're gonna go press the right button so we get into the number, and it's gonna start blinking each number. So. I'm looking for a nine here. So with left bottom, you can switch between all uh, between the different numbers, and with the right bottom, you can change it. So I'm looking for a nine. Then I'm looking for a one on this position. Then the next one is going to be a one, which is already the, there. Next one is going to be a one. So right now I got the number that I need: zero point one 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 nine. Then, if I got the number that I need, um, in this case, uh, I already have it. Um, you can press and hold the left button, 
and you get out of that setting. Then with the same bottom, you can keep moving on that line until you get to the uh, pro and no, right? Um, and then uh, you hit it again and you get out of the programming mode, right? Uh, again, uh, just what I did is press left bottom, get into the programming mode, press the right bottom, you get into line one, which is the one that we're gonna be changing, press the left bottom, and you got this, the first setting, which is quad one, with the right bottom you, you can change the values, but we're looking for quad one. And the second setting, 0, 0.0, and the third setting, we have the number depending on the winch, in this case it's 0 0.1119. Um, so to get into this number, remember, uh, you need to press the right button and you get into the numbers. So when you start changing the numbers until you get the settings that you need. And then to get out of this number, you just press and hold left button. And then with the same button, you can get out of that um, line. Uh, uh, one more thing that I want to uh, mention here, if you want to uh, reset, you need to go to this setting right here, which is on line number three. Line number three, you go all the way to phase set, you can reset the rate indicator. So uh, I'm going to show you real quick. Uh, so I'm going to get out of the programming mode. So you press and hold, go to the menu, you go press the right bottom until you get the line number three and with the r left bottom you move into the line number three until you get the phase set which is to reset the counter if you if you need to uh, so uh, that's it um, thank you